Guys, great to see you again. And the last time we were talking to you, the ink was still wet on the record deal. So how has life been treating you since then? It's been great. Uh, we've had a busy year recording our debut studio album and just released it a month ago. Mm -hmm. um, and now we've been touring it for the last few weeks. Yeah. So, so far, so good. It went to number three? Yeah. Which is. is amazing. It is, it is. Really good. Damn Adele couldn't be budged. Well, I, I mean Adele, she's just going to be at the top of the chart yeah, there for a long time. Forever. So you're in the middle of an Irish tour. You, of course, you guys, you've been to Australia, Canada, you've been all over the world. Do you plan on doing that again? We're in London this week, this Friday, mm -hmm. and then back to play uh, the Big Top in Limerick, which is our, our homecoming gig. So that's going to be insane. It's going to be pretty mental. It's going to be absolutely nuts. Yeah. Now, I wanted to ask actually about the Australian trip, because didn't you end up with like... Your open face, face cut open. Yeah. <laughs> so I get the vibe that you kind of treat tour like a holiday. <laughs> Don't take it too seriously, do you? <laughs> no, look, it's playing music and touring is a great way to see the world. Um, we do party as, as boys do when we go away, but um, yeah, I smell. I, I, I smell. <laughs> <laughs> I fell and I had a I speed wobble in, in Sydney a couple of years ago and I broke my face. But, yeah. uh, you know, it was a cheap lesson, so yeah. I survived to tell I, the tale. I love how you also combined your trip to Canada with the ski trip. That was nice. Oh, Whistler, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, we're going to Canada. Also not the most <laughs> yeah. graceful thing we've ever done as well, the five of us just cartwheeling down a mountain in Canada. <laughs> Recording this album, did you have the live set in mind, or were you like, do you know what, let's just do whatever we want in the studio and worry about that later? Well, we wanted to keep quite um, a connection between our live at Whelan's album and the new stuff. I mean, we had gone quite electric since then, so it was important to keep that. So we included a few songs that have that folky vibe to it. But um, for the majority of songs on it, it was like, let's just throw the kitchen sink at it and worry yeah. about trying to recreate it once we've it done you know yeah, so uh, now exactly. we're just trying to learn how to put all that stuff together now for the tour but it's going all right and i have to ask you about the brand new single as well not your lover who's that about <laughs> we wrote that with pa from walking on cars actually oh, no uh, we were down in, in dingle at christmas hanging out with pa and it's funny i think it's it's typical of that song that you write when you've finished an album in that all the pressure is off so we had just come out of the studio and it's kind of like come on we're writing a song there and you just sort of you don't think about it very much and you're not trying to be philosophical or deep and it's very literal and it's good fun yeah and it's catchy yeah and it's kind of it's our summer single and uh yeah we can't wait to get it out there and i love how you still didn't tell me <laughs> who is it about <laughs> <laughs> i gave you a politician's answer it's about a few people that we'd have seen at gigs and stuff You've like that. You've encountered along yeah, the way. Yeah, exactly. So, um, yeah, I wanted to ask you about that. How, how are you guys getting on with the ladies these days? Oh, uh, I'm great. I'm third marriage. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we love the ladies also. and the men and uh, everything. When 